And the Kern High School District is set to receive $101 million in CARES funding in total from the state and the federal government. 23ABC is Kristen Varton joining us live from Northwest Bakersfield with details on where that money's going. Kristen? Good morning, Austin. Not only is the Kern High School District the largest district in the county, but the largest high school district in the state. That is why a board trustee says this money is very important. Money doesn't solve everything, but many, money does make a difference in terms of resources that we can provide our students. The Kern High School District Board of Trustees trustee Jeff Flores says from both state and federal funds combined, KHSD is slated to receive about $101 million in COVID-19 relief funds. So far, KHSD has received $54 million of that money, putting it towards school strategic spending and personnel for psychologists, intervention staff and nurses. You know, health is paramount and psychologists, the, the, social, the social and emotional toll that this has had on our students. We have to have resources ready and available to assist our students and our parents. Money has also gone toward technological support for students that need it during the pandemic, such as hotspots, internet access, learning management systems, and devices like Chromebooks. There is a digital divide. That, that's, not, um, that's something that's very real in our community. It's, and it was critically important that we give those students without the resources, that we give them access to the learning that they so desperately need, especially during a time like this, when it's all 100% virtual learning. The $47 million remaining has not been voted on yet, but once it does get here, they'll possibly go toward PPE, supplies, staff testing, and KHSD summer school program. Make up for some of the learning loss of this last year and have a robust summer school. I think we're gonna have the best summer school program in the history of the district. So to help help catch up. Flora says this money will need to last one to two years. And of course, we'll keep you updated on when the Kern High School District does open up for in-person learning in Northwest Bakersfield. Kristen Varton, 23ABC News, connecting you.